This is Mark Godzilla U. And this is his mother. Hello. If you could just give us your name. Julie Yu. And uh, where are you guys from? Los Angeles. All right. And could you describe uh, Mark's condition for us? Um, he's autistic. Okay. And um, would you describe some specific symptoms? Um, he has major speech delay. Um, social delays. Uh, some some developmental delays. He's on some areas. He's like a like a three year old. So it, it ranges from like a three year old to like a four year old mm -hmm. in his you know his uh, developmental stages. And how old is he right now? He will turn six Fourth of July. How did you guys hear about the treatment? You know, uh, we just did some research online. And uh, what are your hopes, realistically, to get out of the treatment for Mark? My main hope is for him to be able to communicate better, to get more language. All right. Thank you very much. That's all we need. What kind of changes have you seen so far? He's definitely talking more. He's trying to get his words out clearer. Um, yeah. He's more patient. But mostly, mostly his his language. Subtly, I'm, I'm seeing subtle changes. Oh, cool. Yeah. So, and that's that's the main thing I want for him is to be able to communicate. Can you say hi for the camera, Mark? Mark, look at Zach. Say hi. Hi. Oh, cool. right. Hi, Joy. Hi, Mark. Mark, tell Zach hi. Hi. <laughs> this is the uh, post treatment interview of Mark Godzilla U and his mother, Julie. Hi. Uh, did you enjoy your time here? Yes, very much so. Uh, what would you say was uh, your favorite part? Uh, seeing Mark actually want to play with other kids. Mm -hmm and him trying to talk more. Good, good. Yeah, that's, that's the highlight. Uh, how many treatments did Mark have in total? He had three spinal and three IVs. All right. And uh, what are some specific changes you saw? Um, specifically, he's, he's speaking a little bit more spontaneously. And when I prompt him, his words are coming out 100% clear. And mm -hmm. he's more focused when he's trying to say his words. Good, and good. socially, thank you, Mark. Socially, he's like seeking out other kids now to play. And, and just to be okay, you go open it then. Yeah, so that's like huge. I mean, before he would like play with kids. You want a drink? You want your milk? Yeah. Okay, go get it. Go get it. It's in the fridge. He would, you know, he would just hang out with the kids and watch them play. But now he's actively going and getting kids and wanting to run and play. And it's like, let's go. And so that's like, that's like huge. So mm -hmm. cool. So now he has a, a social life. Great. Yeah. yeah. Oh, thank you. Um, Oops. <laughs> how is the hospital staff, the nurses and the doctors and therapists? Yeah, you know, the nurses are super nice, super sweet. They go out of their way to help you. What do you want, Mark? Okay, just hold on. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> no problem. They, yeah, they go out of their way to. to, to to do whatever you ask, and they're very patient, especially, you know, us mothers tend to get protective and, mm -hmm. you know, and anxious when things are happening with the treatment, and they're just been really super. We couldn't have asked for, you know, nicer people and competent people. They're very good at what they do. And therapists, therapists and doctors, they've all been great. I can't complain at all. Except and about the heat. Yeah, well, you know what? I'm used to the heat, but man, you guys need to put like a beach. <laughs>
Or an outdoor pool. Outdoor pool would be great. Mm -hmm. But no, it's been really good. And it's been really cool to check out the culture. And, you know, I personally, my favorite was the temple. Mm -hmm. Zach, you were there with us. Yes. So it was intense. It was great. Day. But it was like, okay. well worth okay. it. I'm glad we went. Yeah. Okay. Little Mark liked it too. Yeah, Mark okay. loved it. Okay. Mm -hmm. Oh, you want me to get up? Okay. Okay, sorry, I gotta get up. <laughs> and you're uh, planning to come back in March? Yes, February or March. Mm -hmm. So the doctor said it wait at least six months. And so more than likely be March. So it's a good seven months. Good. Yeah. yeah, so we're we're anxious to see what more you know, how much more progress he makes. Because I mean he's only been here a month. So we have, you know, like five to six months of progression to look for. So I I know he's gonna make you know a lot more, especially when we get home and actually start doing our therapy and stuff. Mm -hmm. So it's gonna be good. Great. He's gonna be a different Mark when we come back. <laughs> yeah. And, you know I'm I can't wait to get home and tell you know my friends that have kids with autism and stuff because mm -hmm. they're gonna see the change in Mark and then I know they're gonna wanna come. So it's good. So, thank you very much. Thank you. Thanks, Mark. Mark, say thank you. <laughs> yeah, he's, he's ready to go home, too. <laughs>